Today is National Senior Health Day and Fitness Day, and it turns out helping aging parents is statistically uh, rewarding. According to the Pew Research Center, 88% of people think that's the facts. And nearly two-thirds of people who take care of mom or dad don't feel stressed out by it. But we're helping you find some stress-free ways to help your loved ones stay healthy this morning. 7 Eyewitness News reporter, <laughs> reporter Taylor Nugent live in Williamsville, showing us some ways that we can all stay active. Good morning, Ed and Katie. It's so important to stay active at all ages, and we know sometimes when we get a little older, it's maybe not as easy at use as it used to be, so we've got some ways to make it easy, and you can fit it into your life. Jill, you are an expert here. Walk us some things through us some things that we can do. Yeah, what we're looking at is functional exercises, things that we do every day to make us stronger, improve our mobility, improve our balance. This is Mary. Mary's going back and forth. She's doing a forward and backward lunge. Leg strength is so important as we get older. That helps with balance. When you have weak legs, it affects your balance. And going back and forth, you can see the chairs are in place here. Yeah. And it's always there in case anybody has a fear of falling. We want to make sure everybody stays nice and safe. This is a step. Now, we have two steppers over here. We have Ellen and Cindy. Mm -hmm. And what happens is when people get start stepping, they feel a little fearful going up curbs, going up stairs. So we may sometimes begin with a step touch that Cindy's doing. And then when we get maybe a little bit better and we get more confidence in ourselves, we'll start doing a step all the way up, 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 down, down. Really working on leg strength. And once again, we have the chairs here in case we, we you know, have little balance issues. But the more things we do, the better we get. The other thing here, we're going another lunge over here. This is a lunge, a forward lunge, just working forward and back to center. Once again, working on our leg strength, challenging our balance, and working to make sure that we're able to do our everyday activities more functionally. This is Sam here. Sam's <laughs> going around back and forth. He's going around the cones. For when you go to a grocery store, yeah. you need to walk around certain things yeah. at the grocery store. This is a really good practice to make sure because mobility-wise, we're going in different directions. We have to turn around. Once again, we have the chair in case we fear of falling. When we get a little bit better, we may go a little faster. So it really yeah. helps. So important. And these are all things that you would do in daily life. So your fitness is not something out of your daily routine. It's something within it. So this is something so important to keep in mind. And we are so thankful to have such a great group of women and a gentleman with us this morning showing you all these things you can incorporate into your life and your aging parents and friends as well. We're live here in Williamsville. I'm Twila Nugent. Seven eyewitness. You know, frankly, if you're looking to get active, even if you're sitting at your desk all day, this is probably a really great low impact right. way to do that. Yeah, look that and way. And nice that you can do it with stuff that you have at your house. Right. Or just, you know. A chair, yeah. you got like a step or something, you're Perfect. golden. Yeah.